What's up everybody, it's Max, we're doing it for her here once again. Um, yeah. This is Bellator Onslaught. A lot of you told me not to play this game because it looked like absolute duty. And, uh, well, it came out late last night when, um, I was about to go to bed. My friend messaged me and said, yo, Bellator just hit the marketplace, and I was too tired to bother with it. Um... Graphics are not as bad as they were shown in the um, the gameplay videos before the game was released, but they are still pretty bad. Uh, a lot of people are actually calling this game decently fun while fucking Michael Chandler runs in and decks me in the fucking face with a damn knee and I go flying down. But yeah, a lot of people um, are eating their words saying this game is actually pretty fun and they actually enjoy it um, a little bit. It's a nice arcade wrestling uh, MMA game that they can enjoy. But yeah, I'm Pat Coran. He's Michael Chandler. Oh, by he I mean the fucking computer. <laughs> I'm playing on like easy mode, I think, cause uh, holy shit, I just ninja kicked him in the gut. Fucking yeah, man. This game's a little goofy, but as far as just like a little arcadey style mixed martial arts game goes, it's really not that bad. I don't know if I'm gonna buy it or not. It's 1,200 points. I really don't see this being worth 1,200 points. But there is creative fighter mode. Uh, I don't know how big the roster is, you'll have to look that up yourself, because the uh, demo only gives you these two characters, and um, most of you might not even know a lot of the people in this game. Uh, I don't know how many hardcore MMA fans I have that are uh, watching me, because some of you might be like, who the fuck are these two guys right here, but um, a guy that just got signed to UFC, Hector Lombard, he was the uh, middleweight champion here, I don't know if he's in the game or not, but that'd be cool if he was, I don't know, it might make me buy the game, because I like him, but... I don't know, this game's, uh, the rounds are shortened up just like UFC, but I think they're even shorter. Uh, I don't know, it's fucking really weird. Uh, the ground system I'm trying to get used to, there's only like a couple buttons. It's kind of easy, it's for like new people. And there's a fucking knee him in the gut and the round ends right there. So it gives you um, these grading systems and your health status between rounds and shit. And I think that's pretty cool. It tells you what you're doing good and what you need to improve on by giving you actually a letter grade instead of some tips, and I guess that that's pretty uh that's pretty cool. Spinning back fist, punch to the gut. Some of the things you can do in this game are sweet, like the German suplexes and shit look badass, and I just like fucking teep kick him and he shits himself and passes out. So yeah, Pat Coran by knockout. Gonna go here and hit rematch. But like I said, a lot of people are eating their words saying this game is actually a little bit fun and enjoyable. Because uh, a lot of people were shit-talking the shit out of this game, saying it was fucking going to be awful and this and that. and uh, That's why a lot of you guys didn't want me to play it or upload it to my channel. Well, yeah, I'm doing it. <laughs> if you don't like it, sorry, man. Uh, it's another MMA game to upload to my channel. I don't know if I'll make too many more videos of this. Like I said, I don't know if I'll even buy it. If I do buy it, I'll probably make a couple more videos, but I'm not sure. If you guys would like to see videos on it and would like me to buy it and... Uh, explore all the features and all the characters. Leave a comment below because uh, I will do it and I will make more videos of it. Now the submission system is a little goofy. I think that's what I try to do in this fight. I was trying to learn the body kick so I can lower his stamina down but I kept like trying to go for the takedown and stuff. So I'm trying to get used to the game but Michael Chandler is whooped my ass and like on the hardest difficulty he's fucking annoying as piss. So I could go for one right there but my stamina was low and his is like all the way up so I'm not getting these at all as I go for another one right there. I don't know when I actually get it or pull it off but it might be in the second round. Right there if you're... Jesus Christ you just fucked me up. Uh, some of the animations on this game are like hilarious like you can see how fucked up you get and stuff like if you saw the beginning of the video where I ate that knee and just went flying. Some of the takedowns like the German suplexes actually look nasty and there's actually pretty decent customization for uh, Creative Fighter my friend told me. so. I don't know. But this game's pretty cool. Like I was saying, uh, when your stamina goes really, really low right there, uh, like it did earlier, and it's about to go again, but as I let it go up right there, pretty smart. That's what you need to watch out. Like, here it's going danger again. When you start glowing red when you're in danger mode, and if you get hit, like, once in danger mode, it's like an instant flash knockout, no matter what the other guy's stuff is in. Like, whether he's super damaged or about to lose or what, and... I don't know how to block takedowns in this game yet, but fuck. There, I'm trying to work the body to soften him up for the submission and shit. So yeah, there's a, the 
uh, grading system again. You can check that out. Submissions were an A. He's got B plus striking and shit. And someone just blew off fireworks in my house. And uh, not sure if you heard that, but now the house is going wild. But sorry for that little interruption. I fucking knee him. And knee him again. He goes down. And now I get him in the full guard and just lock in the leg lock. And I'm going to tap Michael Chandler out. So yeah, this is Bellator Onslaught. Fucking go download it. Try the trial. See what you guys think. And I'll see you fucking next time.